Where do you find furniture? That's an excellent question. If money is no object to you, then a furniture store would be your obvious answer. There's your naked furniture stores, your home improvement stores, and your local craft stores have fine paintables. But first, look around your house. There may be an outdated treasure that you want to update. My personal favorites are garage sales and flea markets. Let's check it out. An older piece of furniture is generally great for hand painting. They're thicker, generally better made, and have very nice intricate details which stand out when painted. And this happens to be a 1930s jelly cabinet. It's kind of old, and you probably think that it looks like your grandma's or something that you'd see in your grandma's house. But you know what? When you paint it, it's a difference between night and day. Oh, look at this, this little table. It's so ornate, it has wonderful details, Queen Anne legs, cute little curved drawers, great lines for painting around the top. This is wonderful, I love it. The top drawer, and then we have the bottom drawer. Mm, I love it. Look at this chair, $18. Remember, don't forget to haggle. I wonder if they'll give it to me for 10. Excuse me, yes. how much would you like for this chair? Uh, $18. $18, how about 10? Uh, I'd take 12 for it. Another great place at Bras for paintables are garage sales and yard sales. Let's see what they have. 90% of my paintable projects have come from garage sales. You can find anything, virtually anything, at a garage sale. Anything that has a surface on it, you can paint it. Wood, vinyl, metal, even plastic. I just found my next project, and it's only three bucks. Another important tip about garage selling is to make sure you have a large enough vehicle to carry it home. 